Hello, it is time for the first Mango Olympics Winter Games tournament. It is the Marble Marathon. I've got everything set up. Let's dive straight into it. Hopefully this will be the first recorded and first and last recorded event. Hopefully everything else will be live streamed for you guys to watch on the new MDSN. You like my little watermark I got there? It's pretty cool, eh? Should it go there? Yeah, let's keep it there. Alright, it is time for our first race. We've got everyone here. We've got the norms. We've got Gamer Guy repping the Kachigas. We've got RJ was cool repping the Gromits. Is that Mikey I see? Repping the Gromits as well. Jackson for the Water Noose. They're all here. The whole gang. Let's get ready to marble. Off they go. It is the first race of our 10 race Grand Prix. We could have three Kachigas come in the lead and they'd all get medals. We could have one from each faction. Who knows who's going to be the winner? Let's find out. As they come down here, we've got a very green track. PP Man is the first to hit the rocks and I've got some royalty free music looping there <laughs> that you can it's nice nice smooth loop right there for that music what is going on oh icicle fell off cherries fell off we've got grommet down grommet down big world down I don't really know what I'm looking at here do they go up or where, where are they going okay so they're going into those blue things and then they're falling out here and then where do they go they go down into here Ah, oh, but he misses it. I guess they've got to hit that. We've had three people finish. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's something over here. Oh, pfft. Sorry, guys. I missed this. There's a pyramid. Illuminati confirmed. And here they come. So we had a water news coming first, the norm, and then a norm. So Donkey Kong, Garfield, and Sentry, the king of the norms. How cool is that? So well done, Donkey Kong. You are the first winner. And let's move on to the second race and I'll keep you guys updated with the leaderboard as we go along in terms of points. So they're not the winner of the whole thing for those who've never taken place. They're going to get a point. So I think they would get, uh, I don't know, I think it's like 20 points for coming in first. And that adds on to the next race. And if they come first again, they get 40 points and so on. But if you came, say, second, you'd get 19 points. So that's how it works. Um, and it's the person with the most points at the end of the 10 races is the winner. It is time. Let's get the next song. Uh, I'm going to skip it on my phone. Oh, that was... <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> it's already going wrong. Please, no. My cue. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, I can't edit, it, edit this out either. Oh, it's playing on my phone. <laughs> There we go. Yes. Oh my days. How embarrassing. How embarrassing. Okay. We're back. You can just... You sh should have just skipped that bit ahead. <laughs> uh, Alright. Let's go. Let's get ready to marble. Is this time for the second race? And they're off. Down. We got a Kachiga in the lead, a Gromit, a Morisawa, Morisawa, the Clucks. Now, Morisawa, I had to edit your name because you didn't put Clucks after your name. So I should have to go in and edit that. That's all right. Um, so we've got Kachiga on the right, Gromit on the left, who will be the winner of this race. So whilst we race, and I can tell you about all the other things that are going to be taking place as we go along, I've already, uh, well, for sure, we're definitely having chess, so... Um, that will be an individual sport, not like this where it's everyone. It will be uh, a team specific will have to nominate someone to represent themselves um, for chess. And there will be lots of other things. We've got Jackbox. There will be, uh, we're talking about CSGO, if anyone plays CSGO. And of course Smash I think will be very popular. And we'll both have individual fighting on Smash and teams. So we had Phoenix coming first with Gromits, Water Noose, Gromits. Ooh. Be interesting to see the uh, leaderboard. And who have we got in last place? So we had a Gromit coming in the lead and we've got Gromits in the back. I'm feeling like there's a lot of Gromits in this race, but I'm also seeing a lot of Kachigs. 
Uh, water news. Who am I not seeing a lot? Big worlds. I'm not really seeing a lot of big worlds. Do you see any big worlds in there? Probably screaming at the screen like, yeah, I see a big world. Oh yeah, Manfred von Richthofen. There he is. With the old panda. So this is not going to be the only marble race. There is going to be two more marble race events. There's going to be the team marble race. A bit like, uh, so imagine that marble racing is like bobsleigh. Um, you have the single bobsleigh and you have the team bobsleigh. So the way this will work is on marble racing, we can actually have teams of the same color and the same marble. So they'll all race. So you will not, you'll have to nominate four races from each of your factions. So pick your best marble races. Oh, wait, wait a second. Let's get ready to marble. There they go. And so that will be the team racing. And then there'll be the single race, which will be literally six marbles racing around one track. That's it. Just one track. It'll, you know, pff, I mean, it could be a disaster. We could have one guy just speed on the head or we could have it really close. But it'll be, uh, it'll be six races. I'm thinking now as I say that we could probably do it like they do in uh, the Olympics where they have different heats. So imagine the 100 meter men's sprint. You've got, uh, you know, they have it in heats of uh, what is it like 10 guys racing and then the winner of that goes on to the next day and then to the semi-finals and then to the finals. So we could do it like that. There's lots, so much going to go on and there's probably an event that I have no idea that we're going to do that we'll end up doing. This uh, Olympics is going to run till the end of the month and maybe even beyond. It depends how much we can do and uh, how many people want to take part in things. But this is just the beginning, this marble racing. Um, did I switch the song for this track? I can't even remember. I don't think I did. And as I say that, we've got the first guy falling in. Gums Gang just fell off, but CJ Murph Dog, the leader, the president of Gromits, has come in first, followed by Gambob. And then Peepy Man, three Groms in the lead, a Kachiga, then three Norms, then a Water Noose, a Norm, and a Kachiga. Have you guys seen a single Big Weld in the top 10? I can't say that I have. Let's have a look at the leaderboard. We've got Water Nooses in the lead, followed by Garfield, followed by Norms, represented by Sentry, the king of the Norms. So, Water Noose, Norm, Norms. And then a Big Weld in fourth. That's pretty cool. It is time for the fourth race. We're speeding through this, guys. The <laughs> quicker I can do this video, the quicker I can upload it onto YouTube. All right. It is a nice little Yoshi course. Let's change the music. We've already had that one. Here we go. It is time to marble. I like these colors. We've got Vluch and Teddy Prawn Crumps on the left. We've got Sean the Sheep and Killer Queen on the right. I'm just going to double check, guys, that I am indeed recording. <laughs> I'm super worried that I'm not recording for some reason. I am recording. That's all right. Whew. That wouldn't be good. Okay, we got Teddy Prawn Crumbs on the right. Is still ahead Killer Queen on the left, the Gromits. Ooh, uh, speeding. Speedy, speedy. Grums and Water Noose. And we've got Water Noose, Grums. Let's go slow motion. Water Noose. Looks like they're gonna take it, but who's gonna get second? Remember, second and third is just as important gonna be really close over here oh water noose norm water noose water noose big well grommets grommets water noose grommets kachigas wow so kachigas were just got wiped out that one this is really varied it's good well um water noose represented by teddy porn cumps okay it is time to do the next race there was something I really wanted to say, but I can't remember what it was. It'll come back to me, I'm sure. Um, oh yeah, that's right. I wanted to thank uh, someone whilst we take this moment. Oh yeah. Um, sorry guys, I'm just putting something up. 
I want to thank Super Brittle Monkey for making the thumbnail. That was uh, very cool of them. It's a very cool thumbnail. And it's time to marble. <laughs> it was playing like a newsreel thing. There we go. Ooh. Are those lasers in time with the song? We've got Aldwick, Waternoose coming down first. Phoenix Wright, Groms. Phoenix Wright is a good racer. They've been in the league quite a bit. We've got Sentry coming down third. So it's basically a race between these three. Aldwick jumping through the lasers, dodging them. Oh, does this say something? Exit Seuss, something like that. It's probably the name of the guy that made it. Or lady. Uh, Aldwick. He's gone through the teleporter first, and now the race to the end. They are spinning through this, smashing through that. And here they come. Oh, it's just Aldwick. Well done, Aldwick, representing the Water News. Phoenix Wright representing the Gromits. He looks like he's going to get second. And then here come the what looks like a bunch more Water News. Ooh, it's looking good for Water News. Kajiga, Sanctuary, what's his name? DJ Many Lemons. They're all there. Water news, Gromit, Kachiga, Norms. Water news, Kachiga, Water news, Water news, Kachiga, Gromits. Ivo. <laughs> What's he doing? He's right at the back. Okay, Seal Blubber and Ivo. Oh, will, <laughs> will Ivo? No, no, no. It's gonna be Seal Blubber, surely. Well done, Aldwick. Let's have a look at the standings. We've got Water Nooses in the lead, but close behind Norms, followed by Norms. So Water Noose, Norm, Norms. <whistles> it's gonna be close. Here we go. It's all to play for. So you're probably wondering, am I gonna pick a Marble King? Well, I think so. I don't see why not. The winner of this will get Marble King. But uh, it doesn't mean I'm going to make a roll for every single event. Because that would get pretty crazy. I've already made more rolls than I've made in the in this short like two days. Than I've made since I started working here. But that's how it is. We're creating a cool event. That, that lighting there. Cool, there they go. We've got Water News, Chief Cluck. Ah, oh, the Chief Cluck. So, Joey, congratulations, Mr. Chief Cluck. Did I just stop that marble? Oh, no, he hit the thing. I was going to say, uh, <laughs> did I just stop that with my camera? It looked like it. Oh, they're disappearing. Where are they going? I'm going to make sure I capture this bit. No way, the Chief Cluck. Is he the first one through? Can he navigate these glass? Ooh, we've got a Norm coming on the left. Eats meets Oldwick. Come on, guys. Gromit's Chief Cluck. So we have Norms, Water News, Gromits, Chief Cluck, Norms, Big Worlds, Water News, Gromits, Water News, Gromits. That's Green Man, the Green Man, Oldwick, Yeats meets Sir Joey, Bitsa. Bitsa? Bitsa? Sentry is Bitsa? Wait, what? Do they tie? There. What the heck? What happened there? Sean the sheep, bowl of cherries. B 
Spitzer Sentry the Gorilla. Is that the only people that that's happened to? Sentry the Gorilla. Yeah, look, there he is. Why have they got two names? <laughs> I mean, that. Okay, so that's Bitzer, and then. Is there a. Sh there's Cherry, so that must be Sean the Sheep. Well, how weird. How weird. I don't get it. Who's in the lead? We've got. Waternoose's Norms. No, we don't. We've got. Whoa, who has 52 points? So, Waternoose, Gromit, Waternoose. Cool. It's time for the seventh race. We're plowing through this, guys. So, yeah, will there be marbles next week? Let's get ready to marble. Will there be marbles next week? I don't know. There probably will be, but it will be single event marbles and uh, team event marbles rather than this. Um, and there will probably be something else on the day. Uh, there will be gladiator battles on Saturday. Um, but it will be entered, I think, as a duos. Yeah, so we can have, what is it, 16, 24, 32. And then, I guess, 8, right. I'm thinking about that in my head. Yeah, so 8. Um... Which would be, wouldn't make sense. So 6, 12, 18, 24. So it's got to be 24. So, so four people from each. Now, I'm, I hope the maths is right here. But four people from each faction will have to be nominated to represent their faction in Gladius Battles this Saturday. And hopefully we can stream that live to uh, MDSN. But otherwise it will be on a post-show recording like today. And there's lots of plans I want to do for MDSN. I want to have like a talk show, which will be talking about all the events that have happened in the week, um, interviews, that kind of stuff. So I've got lots of plans for that. Um, it's just my internet is awful, so I can't really upload anything, but hopefully we'll have that sorted. That's why it's kind of been a slow start um, for this tournament and uh, event, but it'll pick up. We've got Yamink Kajigas in first, Mug the Bartender in second, Pixel Gamer in third, representing the Grommets, Swagger of a Black Team, Kachigas, number four, Splash, Splash as a Water Noose, Miss Panda as a Water Noose, Gums Gang as a Norm, The Trash King as a Water Noose, Garfield as a Norm, and Cheese King as a Grommet. I'm so glad Cheese King as a Grommet. That would, uh, there's no other faction that would work for him. And let's get these final few through. There's Wanty. For the Groms. Question mark, 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 question mark for the Groms. And uh Davey! Whoa, it's good to see him. Good to see you, Davey. And we've got a winner, Yum in Kachiga. <laughs> we've got a winner, Yum in Kachiga. It's time to do slope and snow and slide. And if you've got any ideas for events that I haven't announced, and I mean, I really want to run everything. If you are good at something, if you are great at something, if you think you can win a gold medal for your faction, just comment in the video below. Let me know what you're good at. We've had someone who wants to play Forza Horizon 4. It could be as random as that. If we can find one person from each faction, or even one person from at least five or four factions, or three, I guess, because there could be a gold, bronze, and silver. As long as there can be a gold, bronze, and silver. So three, then we will run the event. If we can find three people to do it, we will run the event. So it could be absolutely anything. There are so many people on the uh, manga server that we're going to be able to find someone that can fight you or race you or um, play against you. So whatever it is, just come to me. You can DM me or you can comment in the video below and let me know what you're good at or what you would like to take part in, what you think you could win. And uh, we'll set it up. We'll do it. Why not? It could be anything. 
And we've got Pee Pee Man in the lead. Let's change the music. Come on, we've had enough of this one. Here we go. Whoa, what is this? Woo! Donkey Kong, Water News, Pee Pee Man, Gromits, The Mandes, Big Worlds. So what is this? The 8th out of 10th race? So after this race, you really want to pay attention to the um, order of things. Fat Albert, yes, with the win. Nice one, Fat. Pyro, Pat, Water News. Now, Fat, I saw you in that Marble Pit channel before this started, so I was going to hop down and say hello, dude, but you left by the time I uh, finished what I was doing. But I, always I always appreciate Fat Albert. Always appreciate Fat Albert, they're a good guy. Okay, we're just waiting on Monsieur Vev to crease. Oh, grommets, come on. You, you, This guy... We've only had one guy do this for you, grommets. For any of the factions, just kind of uh, be a clown. But that's alright. He probably had an injury. An injury, oh no. Well done, Fat Albert, Team Grommets. Fat Albert came in through for you, though, grommets. Okay, let's have a look at the Grand Prix. Let's have a look at the standings. The points. It's close between the Gromets and the Water News. We've got the Groms with 55 points. We've got the Water News represented by Aldwick with 53 points. And we've got Donkey Kong representing the Water News with uh, 44 points. Close behind another Water News with 39. So it's looking like the Water Nooses, Water Nooses will get a medal. However, we've still got two more races to do. Can the Gromets maintain their lead in first place and get the gold medal? Now remember how the medals work is the team with the most medals at the end of the competition, the end of the Olympics wins. Even if they're all bronze medals, the more medals you have, whether they're gold, silver or bronze, is what you want to aim for. But if we have, say, two factions which have both 60 medals, we'll then look at the value of the medals. So if one team has more gold, then they'll win. It's as simple as that. Um, but otherwise, you just want to get medals. So having two water nooses come second and third is probably better than uh, Phoenix winning the um, first place, the gold. But at the end of the day, for Phoenix, it's better to win gold because that goes on his record as a gold medal winner. Because we remember we're looking for not only the faction, the ultimate faction, we're looking for the ultimate athlete as well. The person who gets the most medals. Um, whoa, 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 what's that sound? Something's beeping. So there's so much to get. And then we're looking for MVP, which will be voted by, voted by you guys. Someone that you think has contributed in a great way to this. Now, what is this? What am I looking at? I'm looking at a name with no faction. Kruno, what have you done? Kruno, I'm not even going to go and look up what faction you're in. You, I don't even know what you're doing, mate. <laughs> I said to not... To, to put your faction... Oh, well. Oh well, I'll count your points, don't worry man, it's all good. Okay, let's have a look at the points. Gromit's still in the lead and a massive victory there. Even though he came 71st in that race just then. Massive victory. 55 plus 17 and we have 53 plus 8. With water noose, water noose. Now, are these norms catching up? 27 plus 13, that's 40. 44. Ooh. Okay. Norms are challenging that Donkey Kong Water News place. Let's see. Let's see. It's close. This is the final race. This is it. Here we go. So, yeah. Marble King will be crowned today. But otherwise, it is all factions. Look at this. Let's get a nice song. We have had this song a lot of times. Oh, there we go. 
Okay, they're going down. They're into the laser pit. We've got norms, norms, and more norms. I'm inundated with norms and I'm stuck in the wall. There we go, norms. Chief Cluck, Sir Joey, come on, Chief Cluck. Mike Wazowski, Mikey for the Groms. They go in this, and then where do they go? They probably go up this massive tower. Oh, they'll probably fall down it, won't they? Okay, come on, Mikey. Yes, Mikey's on fire. They're falling down. Mikey for the Groms. James Avery, Sentry for the Norms. That one, Mima for what's news. Seven up for the norms. The man is for the big worlds. Donkey Kong, there he is for the water news. That was that would be big right there. Gums Gang and then Ivo for the norms. That was it. That was the final race. And as the marbles fall down, I'm gonna go and find some celebration music. Uh, well done, Mikey. Okay. That's a crowd right there. It is time to finish. <laughs> There's the crowd. They're ready for these results. They're, cha they're, they're, they're clapping because they know. Let's get the first medal winners. The first medal winners. Here we go. In third place. Donkey Kong for the water news. In second place. Aldwick for the water news. And in first place. Phoenix Wright for the grommets. I'm going to take a photo of that. Well done. Guys. 72 points. The grommets. Phoenix Wright. That is a guy right there. Let's get some crowds cheering. Come on. Oh no, that's booing. <laughs> Alright, let's have a look at the results. <laughs> hey, well done. I don't know what this was. They must have teamed up. Like a uh, three-legged race. Who came in last? Who came in last? Cherry, <laughs> oh no, Cherries came in last for the Gromits, but the Gromits came in first with Phoenix, representing the group. Congratulations Phoenix, very well done man. Thank you all for watching, that was the first event, that was marble racing, marathon style. Um, I'm going to go and upload this now, thank you so much for watching, and stay tuned on MDSN. For more live action sports. Well, not live. This wasn't live, was it? But <laughs> I promise you there'll be live stuff in the future. Thanks for watching. Uh, like and subscribe. Leave a comment below of what sport you want to see. What activity you're good at. Um, like I said earlier. And uh, maybe you can win a gold medal in it. Thanks for tuning in. Bye-bye.